Hello my dear beautiful bastards, I'm Petar, your glorious lord, and welcome back to Prison Architect. We're going to build a prison. We're gonna build a beautiful prison with a lot of inmates, a lot of beautifully controlled environments, full of uh, all kinds of people, all kinds of people, from murderers to uh, thieves to killers. Murderers and killers are different, because murderers are sensual killers. You know, murderers are people to, who kill other people very sensually, similar to Dexter. Dexter's kills in the show were always very sensual. You know, he would wrap them up and he would just gently stab them. That, that is sensual. But killers, killers are those people who just, you know, smash people's heads in and stuff. So, those kind of people. And uh, rapists, of course, and, I don't know, people who refused to uh, go to the toilet when they needed to and then they shit their pants or they shit down the, down the floor, down the stairs and caused someone to break their necks. Uh, you know, those kind of people. So, we are going to go ahead and start building. Uh, I don't really know how to play this game, just so you know. I built a few prisons, but I didn't play long enough to reach any kind of prosperity or joy. You know, I played just a few days until day 5 or 6 and it was generally okay. I did okay, but I did not do <laughs> very well. So the first thing that we're going to build is, I don't know the name of the room. The room is called, well, the office, of course, but the other room that we need to do is the reception. Reception, because in the reception you can check for the prisoners and see if they have any kind of weapons on them. It, it's very good to actually get rid of the, the weapons immediately. So we are going to do this. Uh, this first, right? This first. And hopefully that is going to be okay. So the regular door shall be over here. Regular door. This will be the entrance to the prison. So, hopefully they will uh, they will be okay with that. So we're going to build the reception here, and then possibly the office within the same, the same space, because there's no need for the reception to be so big. But I could put like two offices here, probably. There we go. We spent some money, so we can start putting the rooms. So the reception needs to be, they just need to be indoors. So it needs to be indoor. So this is going to be the reception. This is going to be the reception, so we are going to also add walls. Uh, the wall shall be here, like this. This is going to be the wall. So, one office can be here. No, wait, is, that, is this good? Can I make, like, two offices here? I don't think there's enough space. Uh, office needs to be 4x4, four four, right? Yeah, 4x4. Four four. So, this is the size of one office. The size of one office is like this, which means that this is not good. This is definitely not good. So what I'm going to do is get rid of this wall here. Not here, but the wall needs to be here, right? The wall needs to be here. And then we have space. We have enough space to build two offices here. Four by four. And one, two, three. No, it's still not enough. Actually, yes, it is. But there is a wall here, right? Shit. If I do this... Wait, where is the wall? The wall is a problem. Which means that I'm going to need to remove the wall. So the reception starts down here. So the reception will actually be super small. Well, I could, like, extend the reception all the way up here. Maybe extend it a tiny bit. Extend it until here. Yeah, this is good for the reception. And then we go into the room. Reception. Uh, wait, how big is the reception? We need to remove this shit here. So this is the reception, and the reception goes all the way over here. Yes, that is good. That is good. Okay, so build the walls, so I know what I'm doing. Uh, I also need to build two brick walls. Oh no, shit, shit, no, 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 no. Four by four. Four by four, I'm fucking up. I'm fucking things up. Guys, please, stop the noise. Stop the noise, and I'm gonna need to demolish. Demolish this shit here, because I'm doing it wrong doing it wrong please demolish thank you thank you so i need to build walls first so this is the first office this is four by four and the second office is also four by four which means that the wall needs to be five this this is the second office see i need to make walls first that is my first stupid lesson walls first so the reception should not start here the reception should start here is that a good idea i 
don't know. I have absolutely no idea. But I'm gonna make it like this. So this is going to be like a little hallway into the reception area. And the reception area is going to be here. This is going to be the reception area. So one of the doors, the staff door, will be here. And the other door will be here. There. These, these are the doors. This is one office, this is the second office. Uh, one office will be for the warden, and the second office will be for the psychologist, I think. I kind of want to make the psychologist first, because if I make the psychologist first, then I'm going to know their needs, the needs of my people. So, also, a uh, regular door. A regular door right here. And maybe over here as well. Two doors. I have enough money, so it doesn't really matter. Uh, but wait, I need to make another room for electricity and water. And electricity and water is going to be over here. I think this is enough space. Excellent. So we're going to do this. Hopefully that is going to be fine with the people. I don't know, but I'm truly hopeful. There we go. And now I can put the power station. The power station shall be put right here. And the second one is the water pump. The water pump shall be put right here. There you go. And we can also put a capacitor. I'm gonna put one capacitor here. I don't think I need to add more. And let's add the electrical cable. The electrical cable is gonna go all the way down here and then over here and also in this area. So we can cover the entire thing. And what about the pipes? The pipes are not necessary for now. We're going to add them a little bit later. Uh, staff. I first need to add objects to the room. Office desk, filing cabinet, and chair. What else is there to, to put? Nothing else. The other office is not going to have anything for now. So in this office, we're going to put the warden. So wait, the reception needs the office desk, table, and chair. Table is going to go straight here. Office desk is going to go in this corner. And the chair shall go right next to it. There, see? Right enough space. Enough space for everything and everyone. There we got power and everything. Excellent. Power is here. Add the warden. So now I can select the bureaucracy and get myself... Where is it? Psychology and maintenance as well. Psychology and maintenance. I could get security, but I don't think it's necessary yet. Finance. Accountant. I think I should do that as well. Finance, psychology and maintenance. Which means that I will need more offices, but for the time being, this is enough. Polaroid. Oh, Polaroid. Look at the warden doing his job. Okay, remove that. Move that, please. Okay, thank you. Because it has been moved. So, next step would be to create the holding cell in this area. We need to create the holding cell, the kitchen, and the canteen. That is the first step. So, we are going to do that. All of that stuff is going to be done here. I think this is enough space for now. You know, for now, for now. Just don't be, don't tell me that I'm doing things wrongly because I know, I know that I am. Don't worry about it. Just trust in me. Trust that I will be able to do stuff properly. So wait, if I put the holding cell right here, I need the jail door, right? So if I put the jail door here, it's going to be nice jail door and then if i make the connection to the canteen and the kitchen over here huh, can i make some sort of a pathway over here yeah it's gonna be fine staff door i'm gonna put the staff door here and the staff door here aha aha that is good that is good staff doors all over the place a brick wall right here first i need foundations okay Give me the foundations. Build me the foundations. Beautiful. Foundations. And now I can put this here. Nice. And then I can add another wall here. This is the kitchen. And this is the canteen. The canteen can be expanded all the way over here. While the holding cell will expand into cells over here. Is that a good idea? I have no idea. <laughs> is that a good idea? I have no idea. We need more doors as well. Stupid doors. Staff. Staff door. Uh, up or down? 
not yet, not yet. First, let me assign rooms. So we need holding cell. This is the holding cell. This here is the holding cell. It's very, very large. Uh, then we have visitation, common room, not yet. Not yet, please. Kitchen is right here. Canteen is right here. There. Cooker, fridge, and sink. Let's add that first. This is the cooker. This is the fridge. And the sink shall be placed here. There. And now the entrance can be anywhere, really. Anywhere. Step door right here. Now we can put the canteen as well. The serving table shall be here. And then we shall put the table right here and two benches on each side. Wait, I think I fucked up. Maybe like this, one bench here and one table here. And then the second table here and the second table bench there. No, wait. This bench. I want to put this bench here. Is, does this make sense? Because see, there is... The space is different. I don't think that's a problem. Should be fine. And we need to add electrical cables as well. Electrical cables all the way over here. And uh, wait a second. I need to add more stuff as well. Uh, there will be... I will need to add pipes here. And I will also need to add pipes over... Wait a second. First this. Let's add another capacitor. Because I feel like I will need another capacitor. Uh, so wait. The holding cell still needs objects. So the holding cell needs a bench or two. I'm gonna add one bench right here. Just a tiny little bench. And then wait. The canteen. They will need entrance to the canteen. We'll add a simple door right here to the canteen. Uh, water for this area. Yes, yes, excellent. I can do that. Water here. And also I will add the showers and the shit shitters over here. Not too many of them. This is just, you know, for the time being. For the time being, things are going to be like this. So, one, two toilets. And where is the shower? Shower head is right here. Three showers and I'm going to put a drain where? A drain next to the entrance. Because I think that's how it works. And another drain here. Two drains for now. <laughs> I don't know how that works. Hopefully it will be alright. Not sure. But I am doing my best to make things right. Doing my best to make things right. So staff. I can hire a psychologist already. I can also hire a cook, so let's put the cook over here. I don't need to hire guards yet, so I think I have everything that I need for the time being, you know, for the first line of inmates. Should I put the psychologist here, or should I wait for the accountant and then put the accountant here? I feel like I really need the psychologist first, but where will I put the accountant? I could put the accountant here, because there is enough space for another room, right? I feel like there is enough space. Yeah, I think there is enough space to do everything here. Okay, just I just need to make sure that everything works properly. So this room here, there will be an entrance. Staff door right here. And then I need to add a brick wall here. And then add another staff door. Where? Shit, how, how are people going to enter the warden's office? Wait, so this could be the room. <laughs> this is the room. This is one office. Which means that I can put the brick wall here. Okay, change of plan. Change of plans completely. So this is the office. I'm gonna remove this office completely. And then the office will be here. 4x4. Four four. And then I can put a proper brick wall here. So there is space here. And this is going to be closed as well. And then a staff door here. There. That is it. That is it. Baby, this is it. Wait, staff, can I put the janitor? Oh, wait a second. Uh, bureaucracy. Uh, I need 2,000 for cleaning. Foreman needs to be in his office. Excellent. So, first, I need to put more office desks and shit. Okay, so the prisoners are coming soon. Everything is good. I just need to hire guards. I'm gonna hire one, two, three, four guards. I don't think I need more. More than four. So these two offices have been created, so we can put the psychologist here. Wait a second. I put the chair. Oh no, shit, shit, shit. Wait, stop. Rooms. Office. This here is the reception, right? So I need to add that to the office. 
And now the office is good. Yes. So, psychologist here and foreman here. Foreman. And now I can go over here and hire cleaning. Because cleaning is necessary, because shittiness happens. And I don't want too much shittiness. See, we have 7,000, so it's pretty good. Uh, everything created. Are we good? I don't have any windows, but I don't think it matters too much. There, so... Wait a second. Maximum safe capacity is zero. Why just zero? That's not nice. Oh. Oh. Oh, what's happening? Is everything okay? Hopefully. Yeah, everything should be nice. So now I guess I can check over here and see their needs or how does that work i have no idea how that works but wait i know I'd, i know that i need to build a room close to the psychologist where they can go to counseling ah the classroom but i need education for that is that it or i don't know i have no idea i think i think it's gonna be fine i think we are going to be fine I have seven thousand so i have enough money and i have everything going pretty nicely yeah, I think we are good. I'm gonna pause it here. So, thank you very much for watching, prisoners. Yeah, it's not good. It's not good. Wait, one prisoners are unable to be assigned a cell. What do you mean? Oh, I need to put him two hours into solitary. Well, shit, man. I can't really build a solitary already. We're gonna build a solitary next time. So, yeah, thank you very much for watching, my dear beautiful bastards. I hope you're enjoying my building skills in Prison Architect. I think I'm doing things correctly. But make sure to let me know if you think I should do something differently, and I will try to fix it. So thanks very much for watching once again, and I will see you next time. <laughs>